Hey guys, I want to give you a very quick demonstration of the loud relief knob in Manic Compressor. What it does is it lets you drive the compressor harder without destroying the original dynamics of the track and without getting super pumpy. Now since that makes absolutely no sense, let me give you a quick demonstration of what it does so you can actually hear it. Here we have Manic Compressor on a drum bus. Now with these settings it's not actually doing anything because the threshold is all the way up to zero, so we're going to hear it essentially bypassed. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the threshold down. And I'm going to bring it down so that it's at the point where it's compressing really hard. Now I'm going to slowly bring up the loud relief so you can hear what it's doing. I can even bring that threshold down a bit more now. So let's bypass. And bring it back in. Okay, so to give a little bit of a technical background on what this knob is actually doing, what it's saying is, okay, I'm going to compress this with this threshold and this ratio, but as the sound goes significantly above the threshold, I'm going to start easing up on the compression a bit. And that's why you can get, as you compress harder, it suddenly starts to lighten up and compress lighter. This is a characteristic that I see in a lot of hardware compressors. And that's why a lot of people love their hardware compressors, right? They say, I can push this thing really hard and it still sounds good. And so that's what the loud relief knob lets you do. It lets you push it hard and still sound good without having to spend thousands of dollars on a compressor. So again, let me show you the difference between loud relief turned up and loud relief turned down. Okay, so hopefully that clears up any questions you may have on what this knob does. If you have any situations where you found it works really well, uh, I'd love to hear about it in comments or an email. Uh, just help everybody else out who is learning how to use this stuff. So thank you for watching and bye.